Greetings and salutations, Tube Dwellers. Welcome back to Far Cry 3. I am your host, the Mad Bag. Let's jump right into the action. I just snatched up some treasure here, but this... I mean, look at that. Come on, now. Come on, now. That is... that's way too fun. There's no way. This can't be skipped. I can't just not go ramping off of this. Let's get some good, uh, some good distance here. Uh, that's not good enough. That's not good enough. I want more hill and more distance. And while you're at it, more cowbell! Alright. That's gonna be good. Here we go! Oh yeah, don't stop me now. Don't stop me, debris. Oh yes! That did not go nearly as awesomely as I thought it might. That was pretty much just a straight crash and burn roll right down the hill. I was really hoping that that was going to amount to, uh some air time enough maybe to land on the other side of this bridge or, or you know I don't know maybe maybe get just across the water no no not at all none of the above alright more outposts more radio towers I'm just gonna hit them in sequence one after the other I'm gonna go ahead and chop out this in between because I'm gonna try to get chests along the way and uh, probably gonna waste a lot of time doing it I've gotta say that I really love the rolling hills here in Island 2 I think I've said it before at some point, just an open plane that you can actually just traverse straight across. Oh god. Just saying something about rolling hills. Uh, generally though, there is a difference. You know, there's the one-off cliff still that you'll run into, but there's just a subtle difference between the terrain in Island 1 and 2, and I love that. That's awesome. That is a great little twist to throw in there. Just be able to basically drive straight over to your objective. I've wanted to do that all game, and uh, on Island 1, that'll straight fuck your vehicle up. Just destruction on the vehicle. Um, we have Freaker Plants. Do not want to be a part of this world anymore. Uh, let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and open cautiously here. I don't know if we'll, uh, maintain caution. There's a sniper over there. Not gonna be able to get the tag on him. Uh, but I know he's there, and this building really feels like it's blocking some view. Although I do have a ladder up this side of the building that could give me a better tactical view. I'm almost sure that by the time I got to the top of that ladder, I would be technically trespassing. I'm thinking that this, uh, alarm right out here is really out in the open. I like the looks of that a lot, actually. So, uh, let's see if we can go... Oh, it's a sniper. That's right. I thought I was pulling out my bow. I don't even have my bow on me. Uh, was there, let's see, what was it? Was it the, uh, was it the bird? Was it the freaker cassowary? The gigantic ass cassowary? The yellow neck, that's what it was. The yellow neck cassowary that I had to, uh, to sniper hunt. I think it was. These soldiers just cannot believe that sand and water together might be called something different. Whoa, okay. So that's how that goes, huh? Well, uh, let's just go ahead and... Let's get wicked here, the right way. They heard the gunshot. They didn't see me yet, though. Nobody has spotted me, which is awesome. There's a sniper that wants to spot me, but he's just too slow. And once I'm over here, he's probably already lost track of my positioning. And if he hasn't... Oh, he still hasn't technically seen me. He, like, I'm on... I'm on the periphery of his vision. He feels like he should be able to see me, but he just can't. Oh, and watch this. This is too beautiful. Oh, 660 experience multi-kill. I'll take it. You know what? I'll take it. I'll not even complain about it. Jug looked at me at the last second, right as he went down. We got a fire over there even. Oh, oh, he thinks he saw something, but it wasn't a full-on note. And I guess that whole time I was walking. That would make it a little easier for him to see me. Uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and blow it wide open at this point, since I don't have a real good shot on him anyway, unless I pull out that sniper rifle that I just don't want to use. We've still got one dude up here. I don't see an icon for any more jugs. We may have some uh, happenstance reinforcement action, though. Come here, Head! Is that it? Is that final kill? Never seen it done faster. I wouldn't say that was, uh, sneaky, but it, it definitely wasn't loud. No, that was undetected. Fuck, sneaky. Sneaky doesn't even matter. I'm just icing heads before they even have awareness. Before awareness is even a possibility. Before they're capable of awareness. 
I'm making them capable of dying. They, will not make they die well. Oh yeah. Let's get the free ammo before I uh, go buy all my ammo back up. And let's get rid of this dreadful sniper. Christ, I thought we were done with that part of the game. The memory card will be... What? What is it? What is it? What do I got? Meth pipe! Sweet! Mushrooms formula? What? A meth pipe taught me how to make mushrooms? Maybe that's so. I could almost see that happening. Uh, am I full? I'm full up. My syringe kit is full. A bow it shall be! I've gotten rid of the sniper, I've picked a bow back up, and I made a bunch of explosive arrows. I've got no fewer than ten. Fuck yeah. Uh, and actually, explosive takes a grenade, right? I made ten of these, I just used ten grenades. I had a max of twelve. I am deducing very quickly that I should probably go buy more grenades before I take off. Let's do that. Grenada! I need a magazine! Maybe a quiver instead, as the case may be. And uh, at that rate, maybe like a, a grenade pouch that I can just jab the uh, grenade arrows down into. That would work equally well, I think. You know what? I see... Oh, and it's in vision. Look at that. I was flipping out a little while ago, really just wishing that I could, I could find an outpost, that I could just spot an outpost by looking around, seeing some black smoke. And just getting on the hunt without even using my map. And look at this. They have gifted me. Oh, this is about to be ugly. Oh, my God. <laughs> Why did I even go up the hill to begin with? We shall never know. But I shall go up it again. And this time, we're going to make it. Right up to the radio tower. That I spotted out. With my very own eye. I spy a radio tower to climb. Uh, let's see, we're gonna have to go down and around, right? Okay, okay. I feel ya, I feel ya, woo! Hefty jump by me there. Almost overshot my go. Oh, premature. We're gonna have every type of wrong jump. Just wait, when I get to the top, you will see one of the final types. <laughs> one of the fatal types. Wow, what in the f, f stick is going? They're just like. Oh, there's Rockyot. Are those Rockyot? I so want to kill him. I so want to just. I want to spice up this radio tower climb. Oh, wow, what? How did that not just destroy their world? How did that not put their world on tilt? Um, let's see, I guess I go across, I don't know. Something over there. Maybe I do this? Oh, this is crazy. I don't know how much I like this. Oh, okay, okay. It is doable, we're getting there. Let us continue to climb. Um, oh, I'm lost. I'm lost! What do I do? I have gone astray at some point. I need to climb up that side. Wow. This is so weird. No, maybe not. Maybe there's a... A little bit of a beam. I don't understand how to get through here, but I feel like I need to. I feel like I need to be... Uh... I can't. I can't step across that. Christ! I don't know what to do! I'm flipping out, man! Too high and mighty. Okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's take another... No way, that is way too high up. I was gonna say that... Oh, oh, wait, what's that? Okay. Okay, so how do I get there? What? Was this whole thing a detour? Am I really supposed to just, like... Well, no, maybe not. Huh. I don't... Am I supposed to jump down from above? Wow, hold on. I think that's actually what I'm supposed to do. And that is really crazy. So you've gotta go around this. Whoa! And I actually have to... Uh, essentially backtrack going down. God, this is such a weird jump. That's not even being held on there. What is... Oh! oh, oh. It happened. It happened. It worked. Look at me! Parkour master. Uh, I will be wearing a diaper 
from here on out. It's going to interrupt some of my uh, parkour ability to some degree, but it will definitely help the filth. This issue that I'm having right now with the filthy drawers. Finally, home stretch. What do you got, Radio Tower? This better be something good. I think that was that was at least the trickiest bit of parkour ever. I'm not sure if that's the hardest one I've ever faced, but that was the trickiest. Having to jump down like that onto a little speck of catwalk. I will not be looking forward to more of that in the future. I won't be looking forward to the radio tower that I have to climb halfway up one side and then use my wingsuit to whirl around to the base of the other side and climb all the way up it. I foresee in my future a very difficult radio tower to climb. Boom! And as if that gave me any perspective whatsoever, uh, I'll just generate a uh, new... You know, as a matter of fact, uh, so my objective's over that way. I see black smoke though, right? I see black smoke that way. It's straight north from here. Due north? Uh, I'm just gonna zip line it. I know, boring. Why not wingsuit? Uh, well, because I can drop off early the zip line and hurt myself. And actually, it took me right to a Jeep, which is exactly what I want to be rocking. And uh, we're going to get back to chopping until I get to the black smoke. I see that black smoke. I'm getting close to that black smoke. I'm actually seeing a treasure chest, too. This looks like it's going to be the zone. And though I have been loud in the recent past, I think... Just as any man would as he ages. I'm gonna slowly quiet down. I'm gonna lose some of my bluster. And I'm gonna get a little tactical. Maybe, uh, maybe get a little wise. One, two, three piece. Four for the guard. Five in the back and a sixth with a Komodo dragon that wants to be released. And we have Jug. Was looking for that Jug. What do you want to bet there's one in the top of the outpost too? I would bet so. Wouldn't be surprised if there were one on the ground behind this little thing over here either. I think, uh... Okay, I see my red line. I think for starters we're gonna go... Um, let's see. I wanna say like right in this area. Maybe a little higher even though. I think a little bit higher. I'm actually not sure. Oh, that's way past. Way past. Way past. Wow. Glad I brought a lot of arrows. There we go. There we go. That's exactly what I was looking for. I just want to see if in the middle of the chaos I can... Yeah. Okay. Cool. They did not see that. They wanted to see it, but they just didn't. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay. Now... Uh, we're gonna switch off, I think, right? I'm, I'm thinking I'm hitting my key. Oh, man. Hold up! Hold up! Okay, it's leveled back out. Let's try this. Let's try this again. Blick him! Oh, I love how fast that is. Oh, yeah, you like it, don't you, Jug? Oh, give it to me, Juggy baby! Yeah! One more. I feel it. What I feel is a little alarm coming on. And if I can get up here fast enough, maybe I can keep that from happening. Nope. One alarm went off, but you know what? They shan't get another. Oh, that's right. I can't actually... I can't shut it down once the reinforcements are on the way. I totally forgot about that. That is probably going to break this situation for me. Um, let's take a little bit of time right here to go ahead and gauge these uh, reinforcements. That, that's the west. I need to, I need to check out east. They're... Riding up on me. Right? Anytime. Oh, I see it. Jugs and a Jeep. Okay. Well, here we go. This is how this is going to start off. And then uh, this is probably how this is going to wrap up. Something like that right there. Uh, let's go ahead and because we have the time, let's reload that and let's come this way. Uh, this looks a little dangerous, but... I think we can do it safely overall. And I think they're gonna lose me real fast. Oh, maybe not. Woo! Okay, maybe so, maybe so. 
there's no way they can account for how ridiculously fast I can swim over my mere hours of training here on this island. I have uh, acquired the qualities of a fish in water. Oh yeah, get down with me, face. You might be able to say that an outpost is a base. Well, we are here to drop the base. Why did I do that? Why would I have done that? Come on, you gotta admit, it would have been one of the coolest assassinations ever! Ah! Okay, do you guys want to see the entire clearing of this outpost again? Um, no, I'm actually thinking you don't. Let's just zip! Finish that one off, uh, somewhat similarly. Actually ended up going fully undetected and finished it off with some C4 on a, on a jug. Uh, so there it is. I actually got a skill point, and I think that makes two. As always, I'm neglecting three! Jesus! Even better, uh, I'm close to decked, aren't I? What do we have here? Stone wall, sure. <sighs> Why not go ahead and finish this tree up too? Fire retardant! Retardant in flames! And I guess I've just got a couple more. Longer syringe potency. Let's go that way first. <sighs> And then here pretty soon we're going to have uh, line gunner, soft landing, and cool gunner. Cool gunnings, man! What does this outpost have to give me? Ammo. As per usual. Something more, though. Something inside. Uh oh! Am I right? Am I right inside? I think I am. What's it going to be? Huh. Okay. Okay, buddy. <laughs> uh, I used I used some regular what? Okay, I just picked the arrow back up. That was a crazy sound effect for me taking an arrow out of a leg. It sounded like I broke the bone in the leg in order to take the arrow more safely. Uh, as you can tell though, I I used some regular arrows. Uh, somewhat Look extensively. You know, warrior. you know, you take a look at I've had a couple board. people say something about a bulletin board, and I've had a couple different game notifications say that I'm unlocking new missions, but, uh, Who's the man? I don't Me? see that. And it actually just gave me the warning again that this is a restricted area, and now it's not. So I don't know what in the Sam hell's going on. Whatever it is, though, it's not right. More treasure I can see. God, they make it hard to not go balls deep on the treasure. Get inside, dim cold and sugar walls. Okay, what do we what do we got? What do we got? That was an outpost, right? We got another close one. Can I verify by by visual? Uh, do I see black smoke there? That looks like it might be a little tail of black smoke. Oh, that's black smoke. Hell yeah! There's an outpost over there. Do I see any? Radio, oh, I see black smoke there. There's an outpost. That's going to be the next one. Straight that way. Ooh, that looks like it's a couple mountains over. This might be good. I may have found... Huh, I can't even see the black smoke now. It's close. It's right on the other side of this hill. I may have found... A back door. Wouldn't it be nice? I think it would be. I think it'd be real nice. I'd love to find a back door into this nasty little outpost. And you know what? I don't have radio coverage, but I know a loot chest when I see one. And I just saw one. Knowing my luck, though, it's not the only one in that cave, and I will have to return. Okay, so where am I now? I swear I'm not on... Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so do we have, do we have, do we have a... A radical option here? I think we do. It's just low enough. Uh, maybe I'll land. Yeah, those trees actually look like a decent place to approach it from anyway. Oh, the jump didn't happen. I did not jump. Oh, God, it hurts. Oh, God. Oh, no. I'm still alive somehow. This is a fate worse than death. Oh, I want to kill myself for some reason. It's not going to happen, but 
these guys, they think something's up. They know, actually. They're getting right out because they see that I'm hurt. But they're too late! Down they go. Okay, I think now we can I can heal myself and we can carry on here. Uh, that did not <laughs> work nearly as well. Sometimes when you just run off a cliff, you can keep holding shift and Jason will automatically go into wingsuit mode. You can just continuously hold shift. Uh, most of the time I jump, just for safety's sake, and just to get, you don't really get extra height, because, uh, it takes a while for the wingsuit to flip out, but, I didn't jump, thinking that, that he'd just do the run, I mean, it was pretty obvious that I'm running, I guess it wasn't, I went into a slide, what is this, this is crazy looking, this is not what I was expecting to approach this, uh, outpost, I was actually thinking I was gonna land in those trees and kinda besiege it, from uh, just outside of line of sight. Now I'm thinking not. I'm thinking I haven't gotten a bead on any enemy here. I do, however, have a bead on, I think, both alarms. Are they both right here on this end? Can I find a way up here? I think so. This is going to give it to me, isn't it? It will give it to me. We're just going to have to get a little bit dynamic with asking for it. Okay, well, you know what? I've got a little bit of perspective, and I think if they saw me right now, they wouldn't even think anything was up. Uh, which honestly probably means I don't even need to be crouching. Uh, this guy up in front, I don't, I don't see anybody else around. I don't see anybody right here. Now, knowing my luck, there's probably somebody right inside that door that saw his head dip. And if any other... Whoa. Who saw it? Who saw it? I don't think it was him, I think it was somebody else. If I can just get up, I passed an alarm. It's right here. What is it, inside? Oh god, the alarm is not right here. The alarm is around this corner. There's an alarm right here. If I need to, I think I could just emergency get, get to it. All alarms disabled, and I'm hearing something. I'm hearing a creature of some sort. I think in a cage nearby. Maybe not. Maybe that's not what I'm hearing. Look at this guy. I'm just going to steadily take basically everybody here totally down. I think I've got uh, happenstance reinforcements coming up on the back end. That guy saw it. Probably saw me peek back. What is going on? There's a guy right here. I wonder if I could catch that whole tower on fire. I kind of think I could. If not, he doesn't like life by now. And uh, I'm getting ready to, I think, knife. I think knife is what's going to happen here. I'm going to knife take down. Uh, one dumbass or the other. Which one's going to move first? Make your move. Make your move. Oh, oh, we got a guy right up on my piece. He's right up on my bit. I can feel him wanting to do it. They're so scared. They gotta know now, right? They gotta know. Oh, it was a jug! That couldn't have been more perfect. We'll finish him off. And uh, apparently that last guy doesn't need to be killed. He killed himself. I heard gunfire at the last second. He must have shot himself in the head. Oh my god! No, the Komodo dragon got him and now he's trying to get me. The fuck off me. I got that perk. Didn't you hear? I got that perk, son! That perk that makes you not do shit! Jug, yes, that was the proper takedown as well. It gave me the loot and everything straight away. My favorite way to dispatch a jug. A mine, I should use more mines. Uh, and then I guess we've got some celery to do. All right, so where is that radio tower? It is right there, and this ridge looks a little gradient. Uh, enough so that I think I can probably just drive up it if there's a vehicle anywhere around. I'm not totally sure there is. Some rock yacht just showed up, right? Surely they brought a vehicle. Tell me these guys aren't as stupid as I know they are. Nice! I don't know if this is theirs or not. It actually looks way too well parked. There's actually even a path right here. Yeah, this looks like it goes right up to Zeredio Tower. It does look like a footpath, but that's alright. I got a jeep. 
It's just a Jeep thing. Driving on footpaths. Or right back to a proper road. I'll take it. And apparently, I will be inspired by this music and want to do the cha-cha. Oh, whoa, oh, I got angry. I don't know. Uh, just needed a little bit of uh, non-standard stress relief. So what are we dealing with here? I think, is this, no, no, okay. I think I understand. I was wondering when they were going to require this since I've seen, oh, check it out. They've even got a zip line for it, so they're just gonna let you know. Hey, by the way, you gotta do some dynamic stuff to even get to the base of this radio tower. All right, I'm down for it. I've been asking for it, honestly. Yeah, I can see the climb from there. I'm gonna go ahead and do this just to be more exact about it. I could probably have used my wingsuit parachute combo, but uh, likelihood of failure there is very high, whereas likelihood of failure here was zilch. I would like to think, generally speaking, that I don't fail with the wingsuit, but I'm sure my stats reveal. <laughs> Probably in this episode alone, my stats reveal. Failure with the wingsuit is a common thing. If you touch anything but water with y'all face while wingsuiting it up. Uh, yeah, I guess it's going to be right across this way. Well, then your face explodes. Oh, and I see... You know what? It's not. I was going to jump for that, and that's probably a mistake. I think I'm supposed to jump for this. And I actually just got uh, some body armor. Didn't get the heal, but that's okay. Now, can I do something here? I swear this is where I was supposed to go. Don't you tell me I'm wrong. My god. My god. Are they really going to make me do, like, hopscotch here? I think they are. Oh, I really don't want to do this. Can I just... I won't fall real far. Can I just go across there? No! I cannot! And I did fall pretty damn far. Far enough anyway to be annoying. And I don't know how that worked, but I just jumped off that where I was going to go down before where I was. And instead he just went all the way up. So go, go, Jason Brody. Oh, what? And I fall again? But now I know from right here, instead of going down, I can just go up. Yeah, check that out. That's awesome. That so doesn't look like a jump that Jason Brody could make. Just be a little careful here, and we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Unless I run out of place. Okay, we're going this way. This way looks way safer. And I can even get it on the tap, so I don't even have to do anything in midair with the right timing. Oh, man. I gotta walk across these tiny shafts of metal, though. That are just freaking me out. Home stretch, baby. Let me reveal even more terrain. I just realized that I haven't bought all the weapons yet, but this is probably going to free out all the rest of my weapons. And maybe not this tower, but I'm, I'm within a, a few towers now, I think. I think there's only like, I don't know, maybe four more. Four max. Maybe I'll check here in a second. When I look at what I'm able to look at. The outpost that I've already taken control of. Gee, thank you for showing me that. A uh, absolutely irrelevant shack. Awesome. And some wooden tombstones. Exact kinds of points of interest that I expect out of a radio tower. Boom. We may have fewer than that. One, two. Two! There are two radio towers left. Thank you very much. Four. Shh. Wow, I'm already over here at the end of the island, and I'm clearing outposts. Here's the uh, Omega Outpost, or whatever this thing's called, the compound. Apparently that's uh, probably Hoyt's little uh, private fortress. Um, and I've been clearing out some treasure chests, but Jesus Christ, there's a lot left. All kinds of treasure left. That's going to have to be it, folks, for this episode, 16 of 18, sure enough. Thanks for watching. I will see you on the flippity-flop.